Yep, guys, here we got 21 decks all sanded out, and uh, now I need to go home and drill and then soften the edges and all that because they're really rough. It's not very nice weather out, it's rainy and it's cold and it's not bad. It's just ugh, annoying. But uh, yeah, I'm going inside now. Sally's all wet because she's been playing out in the rain. So I'm going to close off here and then I'm going to go down to the basement and start drilling all the holes, which is also going to take some time. But um, I'd rather do that instead of having 200 decks suddenly have to do the whole thing. Um, not 200 decks, but at least I know I'm going to be making about 100 um, and possibly more. I still got the things going down the mold, so that is it's going well, it's going well. Uh, but it's, it's getting a little bit like whew, so much to do. But I'm not stopping, I'm not giving up, I'm keeping at it now where it's going so well. So I'm going to take all my decks here, a whole stack of decks, and go down and uh, drill them and then sit down and hand sand them which is that's like the worst part of doing the job to sand them by hand but uh, it's got to be done because they don't look nice when they're all square flat edges like that hey guys so right now i am a little bit cold because it's been so cold outside recently and the last couple of days it was actually quite warm um so we didn't have to have the boiler on and in the night it wasn't that cold but tonight it has really gone cold and I'm like, Whoa, my fingers are like ice. But yeah, I made a whole lot of decks today. I got 41 decks there. And they're all sanded and drilled. And I'm um, ready for putting graphics on. And I'm going to try to figure out what I would put on of graphics. I think I'm going to be using maybe my iSilly logo, which Ara made for me. You know, the one drawing with me holding a fingerboard, like a cartoon. Um, that could be a good idea to use that like a silly deck thing. I also want to make some writing and stuff like that. But that's 41 decks. Um, the fun thing about it is that because they are completely handmade, um, hand sanded and all that, they're not completely the same shape. Some are a little bit wider, some are a little bit thinner, and some are a little bit longer. But that's the authenticity or authenticity or whatever of having completely handmade decks. Um, if I would have had like some sort of machine which could um, CNC drill them or whatever, so they had all the same shape. Well, they would be very even and look nice, but unfortunately I haven't got that. So this is the best I can do. And um, to say it myself, I'm quite proud of what I've done. I love my awesome. And tomorrow I might get um, the charger cable for my DXL or 3DX, 3DS XL. Oh, that was tricky to say. And uh, I pimped it up a little bit. Because I like the great colour, so besides the great colour, I put a monster sticker on. And I think it really looks nice on it. Um, yeah. It's much bigger than I thought it would be. I've never seen one of these in real life. And now I've only have one. I can see there's a bubble under there. Get away. That's it. But yeah, it's quite nice. And um, I haven't tried it yet because I haven't got the battery <laughs> charger. And it uses special plugs. I, sadly, I didn't have any of those. But tomorrow, hopefully, the mail would have been so quick and brought it to me. Do you guys remember my friend Louisa calling Lila 7X? She is in um, a competition. I mean, she's starting education. She's working as well. And she's, she wanted to go to somewhere in the city. I also wanted to go, but I can't afford it this year. But she wanted to go. And somewhere in the city is like a YouTube meeting in, in UK. And she really, really wants to go. And um, she's been there last year. And she know quite a few of the big tubers over there, and uh, they also heard and know about her. But to help her out, there's a contest where she could actually win some sort of prize, a amount of money. And she would use that to help her, because she couldn't afford uh, to go in a certain hotel, which where some of our other Danish friends are going to stay at. But if you guys would do me the favor and go and vote for her on this uh, page here, um, her chances for her winning would be better and if she wins she'll get some sort of money prize who could help her to go over there and have a great time and I think well why don't we just try and help her out what it looks like is like this this is what the page looks like and uh, you can see she got 43 votes and I don't know who got the top vote but yeah well that's her vote and what you do is you go down underneath her picture I believe and if we look here there's a vote button there and you click that 
and then you have to log in with either Facebook or Twitter. I'm going to do it with my Twitter and hopefully it remembers my password and all that. And I will say sign in, <clears throat> redirecting you back to. And there we go. It's now connected in and I think I'm able to vote. There we go. She got 44 votes. So that's awesome, guys. And if you could do that, that would be sweet and awesome. Please leave a comment down below if you did it. So I can maybe have a track of how many done it. I'm going to put the link down in the description so you guys can go down there. Alright, um, but I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. Uh, I feel a little bit tired with my hands. My wrist actually hurts from both scootering doing um, um, the tail whip. Because I, I sprained it somehow. I don't know why. It's not broken, but it's like the muscles are really sore. Plus the sanding the day of all these decks. It's a lot of decks, but it's not even half of what I want to do. I want to make it to at least 100, and that's 41. So, um... Getting close to halfway. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna see you tomorrow. Take good care. Love you all. You're awesome and epic. And don't forget to leave a comment down if you do go and vote for Lisa. She needs the help. And um, it doesn't cost you anything, guys. It just takes maybe a minute. And uh, she has a chance to get some financial help from a contest to get her to UK. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, and good luck, Louise.